everyone. Hope you're having a good weekend. So this past Monday, I actually came home to two subscription boxes in the mail, um, which made Monday actually bearable because it was a horrible day at work. So anyways, I'm going to go ahead and unbox uh, one of them. This one was from Art Atelier, and then the one that I'm unboxing today is from your creative studio. So let's get started. I went ahead and um, just opened the box, but I didn't take everything out. Actually, I haven't really seen much of what's in there, so it's going to be a surprise. Okay, so let's just open. There we go. Got a nice card here, belief in yourself, and a thank you. Okay. Um, I do love that she does pack this very, very nicely, and I definitely can reuse this um, tissue paper. Actually, I'm trying to be very careful about it because I can definitely um, use it to collage or as a background. So, just don't want to ruin it. Okay. So, let's see what we got here. Okay. Um, first thing are these beautiful stickers. I need a better background here to show you. Hold on, I'm trying to find something here <laughs> with my mess. Okay, here we go. Just ignore that it's vellum. <laughs> so these are some clear stickers. Very beautiful. And then more stickers. Love this botanical um, theme. It's a little bent, but that's okay. That's just the top. More stickers. This is a very fall. They're actually kind of more to me, more fall themed, which is great since fall is around the corner. You could say today's low this morning was like 55 degrees here Fahrenheit, and the high was like 73 maybe. Um, typically here in Memphis. It's still like really hot and humid. Like, I mean, we could still get potentially up to like high 90s during this time of the year. So this fall like weather is really great. Okay, so we've got some vellum here. Like I said, a fall theme. Um, let's see. Yeah. Let's see what this one is. This looks like they're actual dried um, flowers, leaves, whatever you want to call it. I'm just going to slide it out really carefully. Yes, it is. Beautiful. I almost don't even want to take it out, like just keep it the way it is because I just like the way it was laid in there. That is super beautiful. Okay, and then here is the stamp set, 10 pieces. I like the little case that it comes in. So let's see, they're just, yeah, they're all leaves actually. Well, almost. Um, it does have a pine cone there and there. The acorn, I guess it's a pumpkin or a squash. Very nice. Um, let me see here, I'm just curious. Aha, okay. So it's not like the clear vinyl ones. Okay, so I wonder what this is. Squirrels and frogs. I don't know if that's the image or if that's just the name of the brand. Okay, so what do we have in here? without destroying the box. I guess I'm going to have to because it's not coming out unless this is one that I have to push out. Actually, no. I'll push it out. Oh, it's a stamp, I think. Come on. Yeah, it is. It's a wooden stamp. There we go. A squirrel. Lots of detail. Looks like it's a pretty good quality one, too. So, I'm pretty happy with that. Ah, mess with that later. Okay. Let's move on to the next one. 
sorry, I'm just trying to find my placement here on my on the screen. Okay, so it's a little vellum pad. See now I love these stamps. I've been wanting to make my own version of this. And this has got Sorry, I just had my eyes examined about more than an hour ago and they had to dilate my eyes, so it's kind of hard for me to focus despite me flushing them out with my saline solution. Okay, afterwards that is. So I couldn't see how many sheets were on there. So let's see what's in here. Open this without messing up the box. It's kind of smushed up a bit, so <sighs> there we go. Sorry for my fumbling around here. Okay, so these are cards. It's like on a well, it's not like 65 pound cardstock. This is a little bit thinner, so gorgeous but it it's almost as if these images were embossed but they're not they're obviously stamped so it's more of the botanical with different words Lunat oh maybe these i wonder if these are the names of the actual plants i'd have to look it up but that's interesting i mean it's there's a lot a lot of different ones Lies fleeting snow. Yeah, that's kind of interesting. Okay, so what do we got here? Another pad. Oh, tickets. They're all the same, but that's still pretty cool. Okay, I think my eyesight is getting better now but it still doesn't say how many sheets and of course that's all in Chinese so but it's still a good amount I would want to say it's more than maybe 50 so okay let's see pride and prejudice ooh one of my favorite all-time mini TV series and I'm not talking about the movie I'm talking about the one with Colin Firth which is the best one, the best version. Don't really care too much for the one with Karen Knightley. Sorry, but not as entertaining. So they're just, looks like images, maybe some ledgers or invoices of some kind, but still really cool. So it's got sort of like a Victorian kind of look um, theme. Maybe that's what the theme is here maybe during that time okay so these are tags so let's see they look like they're tags but old time scenery series animisms i wonder what that is and ignore this ringing phone in the background okay so I wish that the, somebody would come up with a celestial theme because I love this, the different phases of the moon. So one is like a sticker vellum and then actually they're all stickers, I think. Yeah, they are. That's awesome. So one's on vellum and then one's on just regular paper. Look at that. These are amazing images. in different sizes too so that's pretty cool okay so you know that's kind of weird because i could have sworn that when i had pulled it out that there were some tickets but i guess there weren't like some big tickets because i when like i said when i had um you know slit the sides i kind of just took well i did i took a sneak peek but i could have sworn that i had put some back I mean, 
some big tickets back in there. I don't know. Maybe I was just imagining that. <laughs> but anyways, that is it in terms of what was in. This is actually, I'm sorry, this is the September box from Your Creative Studio. Okay, so it's actually a pretty good box. I'm still on the fence if I'm going to order another one from, um, from them. I might. We'll see. I don't know what's out right now in terms of like um, month. The last time I had looked, it was, I think, November that was out. So, uh, yeah, I don't know. We'll see. But um, that's it. I'm going to go ahead and film the next unboxing from um, our atelier. Okay? So look out for that one. All right. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye.